you wanted to see me. Sophomore year, I used to sit in this back row and secretly watch you. I counted the number of times you smile at me and let die on days that you didn't. I miss this place so much. It's where we fell in love. Where I could say things with music when words just weren't enough. And I need to tell you something that I don't know how to say. My song. You were in college working part time, waiting tables. Left a small town, never looked back. I was a fly risk with a fear of falling. Wondering why we bother with love if it never lasts. I say, can you believe it? As we're lying on the couch, the moment I could see it, yes, yes, I can see it now. Do you remember we were sitting there by the water? You put your arm around me for the first time. You made I'm hoping to cry. I really do. make me really sad and I don't want to be sad. I haven't been a good girlfriend to you. I can't come home on the weekends and pretend that things are the way they were because they aren't. And I don't want to be like all of those other long distance relationships that, you know, hang in there for a few months and then break up when someone eventually cheats or things get weird. Who would never cheat on me? I know. I know, and I would never cheat on you either, but... If we're being completely honest, I had, well, I guess the best way to describe it would be an energy exchange. I was cramming for this really boring sociology class and I looked up and this girl was staring at me. She smiled a little too long, which means she was either crazy or a lesbian. Judging by the stack of Virginia Woolf she was reading, she was into me. So I smiled back. I had an attraction and you, you may have had one. Or you might have one. And that happens. Let's just do the mature thing here, okay? This is not an official breakup. And let's just be honest that long distance relationships are almost impossible to maintain. Because both people are really getting what they need. Especially at our age. <laughs> oh, I'm so pretty. <laughs> This sounds a lot like a breakup to me. I know this isn't working. You know I will always love you the most. Thing, not mine. I just don't get it. 
I don't get why someone like you is with someone like Kitty. What do you mean, someone like me? You act like you don't care what anyone thinks, but you obviously are just as desperate to fit in as everyone else if you'll date her. Do you know how it feels to really be on the outside? The black kids think I'm too white, the white kids think I'm black. And, and Kitty's funny and hot, yeah, a little crazy, but you know what? She likes me, and when I'm next to her, no one makes fun of me for once. What's happening here? You coveting my man, itty bitty? Kitty, come on. I'm really not in the mood to deal with this girl right now. Seriously. That's enough. I'm sorry, or what? Or I'm breaking up with you. You do not want to break up with me, okay? I am like a bad Carrie Underwood song once I get going. Yeah, well, I'll take my chances. We're done. Damn, that was quick. You did this. You're both going to regret this turn of events because I will tell you one more thing. Obama's gonna lose. Oh, you. Thank you. You didn't have to do that. Actually, I think I did. Hey, do you want to go through sheet music for Greece? I was thinking about just sing for Sandy. <laughs> I think you'd be really Actually, great. I, I have to go. But I'll see you later in Glee Club. Okay? Okay. Yo, she's like falling hard. Like, seriously. You know, cute and all, but just like, do quickly in that relationship with Kitty and get that one like right out the door. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was so too much. Alright.